Hi everyone, this is Sean Chua from alevelh2chemistry.com Now in advanced chemistry, one of the first few topics that you'll be learning must be atomic structure And in atomic structure, you'll be learning things like principal quantum shell numbers the subshells as well as the orbitals inside them And today I'm going to share with you a strategy to fill the orbitals in order and it's very important A lot of chemistry students find it confusing Now let's take a look using the board now to go about the strategy, first, you must determine the type of subshells inside each principal quantum shell numbers. So we have say 1s subshell in principal quantum shell number 1, and we follow up with 2s, 2p, then we have 3s, 3p, and 3d. In number 4 shell, we have 4s, 4p, 4D and 4F. Let's have one more shell. 5S, 5P, 5D and 5F. Now once we have the subshells in order, what we need to do right now is to draw a diagonal line down from the top right hand corner. Like this. And followed by this one. So on and so forth. Once we have these diagonal lines in place, then we are able to write down the order of the orbitals and we will go like this. Starting with 1s, follow the red arrows here. So we have 1s followed by 2s and 2p. All right? And next we have 3s. And after 3s, we have 3p, 4s, 3d, 4p. 5s, 4d, 5p, and the last three, 4f, 5d, and 5f. There it goes. This is the correct order of filling the orbitals. Now, I'm going to point out something interesting to you. Uh, over here, you realize what? We understand that the 1s orbital, all right, has the lowest energy, and as you go and count, upwards, the energy level generated should be higher. Now, you realize over here, the 4s orbital is actually lower in energy than 3d. And that's why we need to fill up first before the, the electrons go inside the 3d orbitals. Now, this is true because the 4s subshell, the orbitals are actually at lower energy compared to the 3d uh, orbitals over there. All right, and that's the reason why it comes first. Now, I'm sure you learned something very useful today regards to this. Um, for more chemistry tips and discussion of questions, do visit us at alevelh2chemistry.com or alternatively, subscribe to my YouTube videos. Feel free to share this video with your friends. Thank you and take care.